We're building two townhomes in The Sims, but one is for a vampire and one is for a werewolf. Well, the vampire side should be pretty easy. Gothic Victorian. I was gonna say Batcave. Dark, broody, and moody with the siding, right? The whole house of those walls is terrifying. We don't really have garages in The Sims, but you can kind of fake them. Just frame out your space with a couple of columns, add some paneling like this tile. Then to finish it off, take these small windows and place them in a line across the top. Next victim. Don't you mean neighbor? Yep, I'm thinking abandoned warehouse. Warehouse? Was that a pun? It's not a warehouse, it's a warehome. <laughs> in this garlic wreath. Not for anyone in particular. Then should the vamps get the no dogs allowed, Matt? I love it. It spilled soda, obviously. Yeah, what could anyone else be thinking? Does that punching bag have a vampire face? I think it's up for interpretation. It's pretty visible. We'll just cover that up. Hopefully this fountain will drown out some of the racket over there. Let's pop a gargoyle on top. The vampire pack has ivy and brambles that combo really well. Do it on the side too. Once you start ivy. It is hard to stuff. Oh my gosh, how cute these are is an actual problem. 